Maria Jesus Llamas of San Antonio, Texas, a beloved mother and grandmother of many is still missing. On a cold day, November 20th, 2016, at 69 years old, Maria and her husband attended the local flea mart. She was with her husband, whom she had been married to for many years. Mr. Yamas took extremely good care of Maria, as he stated. He would take care of her as long as he had the strength, as she had taken care of him for many, many years throughout their long marriage. No nursing home for Maria Jesus. Many Mexican-American Chicano families do not accept the possibility of a nursing home for our loved ones. We are very family-oriented, loyal, and care for our own. Maria Jesus had a devastating illness, which affects the person with the illness as well as family members in a devastating manner. Alzheimer's disease, a progressive disease affecting a person's ability to function. Symptoms include mental decline, difficulty concentrating, forgetfulness, delusions, difficulty in self-care, and many other symptoms. On this particular Sunday, they attended church, then off to the Poteet Flea Market. This has been a family routine and tradition for many years. Maria enjoyed the live bands and music. She didn't like the music this Sunday. She wanted to go home, and in an instant, she was gone. Mr. Yamas and then the family frantically searched for Maria. The police were notified. She was seen on surveillance video innocently walking in the flea market. Then she was seen walking and leaving the flea market. She was then seen walking on Highway 16, also known as Poteet Highway, as it leads to Poteet, Texas, the strawberry capital of the world, home of the largest strawberry. This is a very busy highway. It's a dangerous road for pedestrians. A witness stated he swerved to avoid hitting her with his car. Later, she was seen on the access road by a woman. She had a flat tire and a policeman was assisting her in changing her tire. Maria stopped and briefly spoke to them. The witness asked her if she was okay and Maria stated, yes, she was going to see Los Muchachos, the boys. Her family quickly set out to search and handed out many flyers. They searched and searched. Or worried search as more time gathered, passes. And, and they searched on foot, horseback, drones, and kayaks. But Maria was not found. The family diligently continued to search the area. They refused to leave for months and months. No signs of Maria Jesus. Her purse was soon found wrapped around a tree near Leon Creek. The purse was never checked for fingerprints or any other clues. Instead, it was handed over to the family in a paper bag. The Yamas family continued to search long after search teams had dissipated. Please continue to share Maria Jesus Yamas story. The distraught family deserves answers. The Yamas family continues to search. They continue to keep Maria in the media. It's a tragic story and we cannot imagine what this family is going through. They're a strong, united and admirable family. Thank you, Maria Jesus Yamas, as you have brought awareness to Alzheimer's disease and you have taught us to take precautions with our loved ones, such as using tracking devices and alarms to keep our family members safe. Maria, you helped me keep my daddy safe at 93 years old until his passing. You gave us peace during times when our daddy attempted to leave the home. He wanted to leave daily. Voy a trabajar, he would say. I'm going to work. Much like Maria wanted to see los muchachos, the boys, on that fateful day. I, Chisme Patrol, will also continue to search for Maria Jesus Llamas. 
Let's bring Maria Jesus Yamas home. Please bring Maria home to her family. She is very much loved. They want her home and they need her home. Dear Lord, please bring Maria Jesus Yamas back home to her family as they truly miss her and they need her home in their arms. Amen.